Hey guys, it's Boy Your Veteran. Today I'm at the park and obviously I'm gonna show you guys how to do a muscle up. So I'm with my boy, he's never done a muscle up before and he's been trying to learn for a while. But still, it's still finding difficulties. So what we're doing is he's starting up with this warm up. It is very important before you start up with your training, you gotta warm up to get the shoulders nice and relaxed, you know, before you go into your training just to avoid injury. So he's gonna do a couple of warm up, then I'll start through the basic. Today I'm not gonna go through every single details. I'll just show you guys the short forms, which are actually gonna help you guys to improve with your muscle up and um, the, um, the tools you need to use, you know, like the resistance band, which is pretty good, you know, to give you that extra leverage to, to pull yourself further. So yeah, apart from that, let's get it started. So just look at the shoulder. Now you try and keep it nice and wide and just lock them on your shoulder level. Okay, and let's switch it up the other way around. Back and forth. Perfect. Okay, stop. What I wanted to do is just go right down. Perfect. He's actually quite flexible than me, you know. What you need to do is try to get a lat area to be to be more on tight. Okay, start. So, the first thing for people who can learn how to do muscle up is you need to learn how to pick up your own body weight. So, what we're going to start with, we're going to start with a lower bar. So, what you need to do is you stand, you jump, and lock in. Down, and lock in. We jump, do it a couple of times. You just feel how you can pick up your own body weight, and it's very important for you to lock in your shoulder. So, contrain your body up and down. So, do it about three times. One. Okay, stop. So by doing that, it warms up your shoulder. Today we're just doing it for a very short case of video. We don't really want to go into long details. So now what we're going to do is we're going to do the second transition, which you need to go underneath. And then momentum. So you go right underneath, you kick with your legs upward to push yourself. It's a one body movement, so you could actually go higher. So go dip in and jump. That's it. That's it. That's it. Four. And stop. Okay. Do that a couple of times, about 12 to 15 reps, you know, about three sets. Then from there, what I recommend you to do is you get one of these two bars. So you got the lighter one and then you got the more resistant band. This is actually more stronger to be able to give you that leverage. So you strap it underneath and you stick your feet over it. And what I want you to do is you swing downward and come back upwards. Okay? Just like that. So it helps you with that transition, gets you a little, little, makes it more easy for you to move around. And then once you do this a couple of times, it's lighter, it's more easier, then we go with a, with a more lighter um, band. Okay, try it a couple of times. Focus on your breathing to as well, it's explosion, one body movement. So you go all the way down and push yourself up. Lock in, nice. Let's go. Two. Let's go. Three. Nice. Let's go. Four. One more. Let's go. Uh, okay. Over. Stop. So, as you can see, it's not that easy. You know what I mean? The whole idea is muscle up is not all about power. The, the most important thing people find difficult is, is just transition from, from your wrist and actually locking in with your elbow. That is what is actually quite difficult. So, he's done it a couple of times with the... Um, with a more stronger uh, resistant band. Now we're going to try with the lighter one and see if it could do two or three reps. If it could do two or three reps, I'm quite happy with that to take him up to a more higher bar. So what we're going to do is exchange that and put the lighter one in. I need a, at least two reps, okay? Two reps. Two reps. It's challenging, right? It is challenging, but it's worth it. You know, just focus on that, on that, um, on that transition. That's all what you need, momentum. Remember, it's momentum to us work. Deeper you go in and explore as fast as you can. Okay. No, no. Them. stop, 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 stop. Definitely no. Okay. You can see, he needs more time to be able to grow 
into a position that he could start picking up with his own body weight. So I'm gonna just take the chance, just for the case of the video, we're gonna actually go at the higher bar. So he's gonna try with the um, with a more um, heavier, band. heavier band. So let's go. So it goes the same. The more heavier band is quite difficult. So for people who actually do not have someone to help them, if you have something like this, always try to keep it where it's closer to you. You step in your feet, getting your feet right in, both of them, stick it in, and what it do is, it just help you back up. That's all you need, okay? So, we're gonna go in. Focus on that momentum all the way down, explosive, and put that transition up. Let's go. Now the pull up, keep your legs straight. Go. Okay? No. Yeah, okay. No. Let's go. Strength. Stop. So, as you can see, muscle up is, um, it's, it's, it's not about strength, it's about technique. You know, understanding the technique and actually mastering your body. Once you learn how to master it, it becomes easy. So, try to walk through the steps that I'm teaching him. You guys will obviously see a progression video. So, it's today for you guys to see that he could not do a muscle up today. But I would definitely do another video, you know, so you guys could actually see the progress, how you could do muscle up. So, I'm going to show you guys two techniques from my side, which you could actually increase to advance from here. And then from there, I'll show you guys the string muscle up and obviously add another trick into it. So two so other technique you want to do is a lot of CrossFit guys always do this. They kick with your legs, you know, and like I said, mo muscle up is momentum. It's not all about, it's, you don't get into a pull up position. You need that momentum. So the CrossFit guys, what they do is you kick your leg up, high knee, and then you lock out. Good. High knee and then you lock out. Like you could see, that is momentum. From there, when you feel like you could do five to six reps, you could do the normal swing. Kick. Kick. Okay? That is actually quite, you know, it's actually quite difficult as well. From the normal swing, when you know you better, then we're going to slow motion which what you do is flex your quad muscles flex your abdominals keep your hands straight focus on your breathing and bring it all the way slow and lock in you know so let's go in down without any swing okay that is perfect from there, like I said, it doesn't stop. There's so many ways you could advance into going to muscle up. Actually, what I did is, I never I forget to actually include that you could actually walk your abs, you do a leg raise, muscle up, which I enjoy doing that. You guys have seen in some of my videos. It's sort of like one of my best momentum one. So you kick up, and then you go up. That was good. Another advanced movement you want to do it to make it more fun and more spicy. It's called Muscle Up 360. Okay? <laughs> that is when you start going crazy, you know, you start having fun to be able to make it more nicer. So, what you do is... So, that is Muscle Up 360. Easy. You want to make it more excited again? You could actually add something more into it. So you could go, ball piece, leg raise, muscle up, 360. You could do a combination now. Like I said, there's so many advances to it for you to go. So what you do is, you go down, up, leg raise, kick, up, 360. So there's so many dimensions into it. Just keeping it with time. These are years of progression. You know, and then from there you go higher and higher and higher. So, as from now, with my boy right here, you know, he did pretty well today. And like I said, if you guys like the video, do not forget to subscribe. Tell me what you want to see next. And definitely there's going to be a progression for you to see how he progresses in the next couple of weeks. Okay? I hope so. From next time, I'll see you guys. I'm out. Peace.